I was a ballerina for most of my early life and the, the discipline around it is very reminiscent to me. I like the hard work. I like being in that gym. The one day should just be working on striking motions with hands. Then the next day we'll recap on throws but then just focus on just weapon work. I have a real love and affection for the discipline that goes into martial arts. The training sessions would go for like three to four hours a day. The hardest part of the training regimen is, I guess, consistency. You know, when it's the amount of hours that you have to do it, I think that's the hardest thing. Because I think everybody can give it their all for three hours in one day, and then it's waking up the next day and kind of carrying the pain from the day before and having to drag yourself back into the same torture chamber where all of that happened in the first place. Training was was intense. It was definitely a sort of strength, speed, agility training, which is hours of every day. I trained for about three and a half, four months physically. Even though I lost the weight, I had to really go and build some muscle back, and get some strength back, and just get physically to a, to a place where I felt stronger and capable of. The team that I got to work with on this film really focused on my strength. We went to Silat, you know, which is uh, actually Indonesian martial arts. We went to the Filipino martial arts with Kali. We went to Northern Southern Kung Fu, like, you know, we went to Hangar. We also did a little bit of the Wushu aspect, it, definitely a little bit of the Taekwondo from the Korean. We also went to Greco-Roman wrestling, um, pancreation, um, went to like the I Aiedo um, with Kendo, you know, which is, they're both Japanese martial arts. So you have to work really hard to get your body to a place where you can sustain for long takes at a time that took a lot of work. And training sessions would go for like three to four hours a day. We had to incorporate just her martial art training first and then do judo and with basic stances, basic motion. All martial arts always has a basis, right? It comes from the ground up. So the feet have to be well and then it works the way up to the knees, to the waist, to the chest, to the head. Gun range, gym. I mean, it sounds very simple when you say like, oh, it was like three hours a day, but it, it became all consuming.